allowed 1.5 hours one way for the road trip, starting from the info center. It was a cloudy with patchy drizzle on that day and a bit of sunshine. For rest area, stop at Lac de Roches and enjoy the view and fresh air. There is no cell reception past a certain point. The GPS stopped us in one place but still not the false trails. Make sure to download the Google and be prepared for an hour off-road ride. You might encounter as well a cow in the road. There is an ample road parking in front of the signage. The waterfalls is 6 kilometers away from the lake and campsite. From the trailhead, it is a short 0.5 kilometer hike to the first falls, Mahid. Falls at which is a 15 meter 49 feet waterfall flowing from a Mahid Lake outlet creek. Once at the falls, there is a fenced viewpoint peering out through the trees looking straight out at the falls. This is a two for one trail. It is a short, easy walk with beautiful views of two separate falls. The Mahid Falls supposed to be a powerful and beautiful twin drop falls if the view is not obstructed by tall big trees in the viewing platform. Maybe someday the trail will be developed so that viewers can see its extraordinary beauty.
Slightly disappointed that we can't see much of Mahud Falls, but for surely, Kanem Falls will be impressive. It is only one falls during summer and early autumn, but during spring season it is. Usually three falls. Look closely to your right when visiting Canem Falls viewpoint, and there is a rough, well hidden, access trail leading down to the base of the waterfall. The route is steep and is covered in loose gravel and exposed tree roots. At the base of the falls, the views take on a whole new feel surrounded by waterfall mist, I was scared to the heights looking down the falls, 